Hi folks, the video I'm showing you today shows you the problem with Einstein's equation and the so-called God particle and the role that could play in the massive increase in earthquakes as I have proven to you in previous videos. As you know, I always try and stick to the facts and showing alternative possibilities um, leaving you to make up your own minds. Eleanor, Nubiru, Harp, Particle Accelerator, maybe all of those, but certainly something. Enjoy the video. Please bear with me. I am not a physicist and I will keep things in layman's terms as much as possible. Let's start with Albert Einstein, who developed the theory about the relationship between mass and energy, E equals mc squared. The theory of relativity, meaning that energy is just one form of mass. But there was a problem with the theory. It just basically didn't add up. And ever since the 60s, Scientists have been trying to discover the answer, hence the so-called God particle, the Higgins boson, which I will try and explain further later on in the video. Scientists, and especially governments, care little for the effects on the people of their experiments. Early trials in nuclear weapons proved this. The first nuclear bomb test, some scientists believed that there could have been catastrophic chain reaction causing our planet to become a barren wasteland. But they could not care less and went ahead to detonation. Fortunately, the chain reaction collapsed Although many service personnel were not informed of the dangers, subsequently being poisoned, irradiated and suffering for years, many of whom died. And now we arrive at the point in question, the Hedron Collider, erected a hundred metres under the Alpine hills of the French Swiss border at a cost of 10 billion pounds and over 800 million a year to maintain. The tunnel stretches 17 miles 27 kilometers. This is the largest most expensive construction the world has ever seen. And I don't believe the globalists went to all this expense to prove a theory, to find a subatomic particle. No, no. They are up to something far bigger, as crazy as it may sound, even possibly time travel. The greedy globalists wouldn't invest unless there was a huge return. The Americans have had a collider since the early 80s and went into full drive in 1995 when they discovered a quark, a subatomical particle. Their collider will probably be closing the end of this year. The European organisation who own the Hedron Collider are called CERN. They were the originators of the World Wide Web. CERN was established on the 29th of September 1954 by 12 European countries. Pay attention to the symbolism on the company logos. 
Some would say it looks like 666. Even the positional structural layout of the particle accelerator. This dome shaped or pineal gland shaped office building. You can also find located several statues of Vishnu with six limbs. One of the directors said, quote, well, we're going to open the door and see what comes out. If nothing does, we'll have to send someone in. I've heard them say that finding a subatomic particle is like trying to find a musical note, a string, a vibration. And now they claim they have finally found the God particle. What this actually means for mankind is extremely difficult to say. It has cost them billions of pounds, but the human cost may be far greater. The irreparable damage they've done to the planet over the last decade, decade and a half, could be the cause of the vast increase in earthquakes from 5,000 a year to 30,000 a year. They have upset the natural balance and increased natural disasters, earthquakes, floods, volcanoes, are growing all out of proportion. The USGS and similar official bodies for seismic testing deny the increase. But the figures speak for themselves. I am certainly not against advancements and progress in technology, but our governments just cannot be trusted. We cannot trust them to do what is right for the people. They are only self-interested and self-motivated by greed. I can only say, if these so-called natural disasters continue to accelerate at the present rate, they will spread far beyond the ring of fire and put all our lives at peril. The Hedron Collider is deep underground and the vast energy used to smash particles creates horrendous vibrations which could potentially rock the very foundations of the planet. As Tesla stated, a relatively small amount of energy vibrated at the right frequency can create a hell of a lot of damage. Recently, a professor claimed that the American government had stolen his patents on predicting seismic activity and earthquakes and had kept them secret. Truth is, this is what we're up against. We are at war with the globalists. The people are at war with the globalists. And the sooner everyone realises that, the better off we shall be. Pre-warned is pre-armed. We can only do what we can. I hope you enjoyed the video and stay safe. Thank you very much.